The Australian Hillsong Church is one of the largest churches in the world. His greatest fame has been earned by his music, which has focused on congregational music production. His music is sung in millions of churches around the world. In this video we are going to learn 8 things you didn't know about Hillsong Church. Number 1 the Hillsong Church was founded in 1983 in Sydney, Australia by Pastor Brian Houston. Now Brian Houston and his wife Bobby Houston have been senior pastors since 2000. Brian Houston's father, Frank Houston, who is also a minister, confessed to sexually abusing a minor in his New Zealand congregation 30 years earlier. Hierarchy had known of Frank's pedophilia for two years what they described in the letter as a serious moral failure. In response, Brian Houston, who was then president of the Assemblies of God in Australia, fired his father, took control of his church and merged it with Hillsong. Number 2. Hillsong Church was originally known as Hills Christian Life Center, changed its name to Hillsong Church in 1999, music renamed the church. Hillsong is a Pentecostal church and denominationally are which is the fastest growing Protestant denomination in Australia. Hillsong is part of the worldwide family of God's weekly assemblies attended by an average of 112,000 people in all of its headquarters around the world. Number 3. Hillsong has 21 churches in different countries spanning five continents in Australia have 10 campuses. In addition they have churches in Argentina, Brazil, Denmark, France, Germany, Israel, Italy, Holland, Norway, Portugal, Russia, South Africa, Sweden, Switzerland, Ukraine and USA where they have churches in seven different states. Number 4. Hillsong Church has its own music label. Hillsong Music. Its music is based on contemporary, congregational rhythm for which Hillsong has become famous. They also have three musical bands. The main band is Hillsong Worship which was created in 1992 that have produced 46 albums with more than 300 songs. His other bands, is Hillsong United was formed in 1998 and is directed by Brian and Bobby Houston's son, Joel Houston and has produced 17 albums. His song Oceans reached platinum status in the US. Check me deeper than my feet could ever wander. And finally there is a youth music group called, Hillsong Young and Free as they claim is the sounds of the next generation of Hillsong music and has created two albums. So we can see there is a big music business in the Hillsong church as its music is consumed by millions of people around the world and its YouTube channels add up to more than 4 million subscribers. Number 5. The Hillsong Church has been the site of important conferences but also of great scandals. The Hillsong Conference is one of the most important conferences in the world. The world's largest annual Christian meetings attended by people of all denominations including the Salvation Army, the Catholic Church, Baptist, and Pentecostal. But there have also been some very unusual performances. On one occasion during a church music show, a group made their own version of I Like to Move It, where they made very unpleasant and sexual movements in front of hundreds of people dancing and cheering this show as if it were just another theater. The church should be a place where its main center is the glorification of our Lord Jesus Christ and we believe that deviating from the vision of praise God cannot dwell in that place. At another women's event at the Hillsong headquarters in New York, 
organized by Pastor General's wife, Bobby Houston, something surprising happened at that event. Guitar with hat and boots performing a dance with other men and women after finishing this video on social networks Pastor Brian Houston issued a statement expressing that they had no knowledge that this man would go up on stage, claimed that the cowboy had appropriate pants and not underwear as many said. Number 6. One of the Hillsong pastors who has been in the media eye the most is Pastor Stephen Carl Lenz who leads the congregation of Hillsong, New York. This pastor has been several times the center of the news for his controversial style and appearing in public with famous figures such as Justin Bieber and also for making controversial statements such as wearing and justifying his tattoos to be light in his position before abortion and homosexuality among many other things. Number 7. It is common to see celebrities attending Hillsong Church such as Justin Bieber and Selena Gomez also photographed on the way out, as well as Vanessa Hudgens Kendall and Kylie Jenner, Oprah, Winfrey Gale and Baldwin and bonus of the band U2 Another pastor of the congregation was the one who officiated the wedding of Kim Kardashian and Kanye West. Number 8. In November 2017 Hillsong Ministry launched Hillsong Channel Now, which is a video-on-demand subscription service that provides access to the original Hillsong programming so that they have an idea is a service somewhat like Netflix. In the period before and after the launch of the Hillsong Channel, which identified that there was a rapid growth of digital platforms on demand, created the opportunity to share the gospel directly in homes and personal devices, also identified that there is a group of people who are not necessarily watching traditional television, but see television content this application offers a first month free subscription and then has a cost of $7 with $99 per month and annual cost of $86.